Hello everyone, I hope you're doing well. If you don't know me, my name's Beck, and I've had the privilege of leading the ministry of Neon Jaffa since the start of the year. I'm jumping on today just to be sharing with you guys about how we're going forward in term two in amongst all of this isolation and quarantine that's now come up due to coronavirus. So our team of leaders have been meeting in the background and working on a bunch of different things. Um, and the way that we've decided we'll run Neon Jaffa in term two is that we will be doing a couple different things. So first and foremost, we'll be running small groups like we will on a regular Jaffa night, um, but those will be all hosted through Zoom. Um, so it's an online platform um, that you can download the app and then we'll be doing Zoom sessions um, as our small group devotion time. So we'll be looking to keep these Zoom small groups as similar as we can to the way that our old small groups ran with the same age groups, the same um, leaders and everything as much as we can the same. This is so that you guys get consistency in the relationships that you're building um, because that's a really important part of Neon Jaffa that we think is extremely valuable. So we want to keep that as similar as we can to the way Jaffa used to run when we were meeting in person. Next Friday, uh, the 24th of April, we will be joining all together, however, um, into one big Zoom meeting just to kind of test the waters so that everyone can get familiar with how Zoom runs and what that looks like. And if we have enough kids, we'll break off um, into smaller groups as well, just to kind of keep that um, familiar format there. Um, but that will be played by ear a lot. Um, but stay tuned for the details on that so that you can jump in and be involved. So in the weeks that we're not meeting together on Zoom, we'll be sending out a newsletter that contains a whole bunch of different things so that you guys are still engaged um, and that we're still present um, and that you guys can have some ideas on things to do during isolation and just a couple other things to be thinking about uh, while you're at home um, during this term. Um, so a few of those things will be you'll get to see more of you and Junior, who is our newest uh, Neon Jaffa mascot, if you want to call him that. So you'll be seeing more of him this term um, just through emails instead of in person, which you might be thankful for because you won't be able to hear him. A couple other things that we'll include in there is some memory verses for you guys to memorise while you're at home. If you're sitting around twiddling your thumbs, it might be a good chance for you to be learning some scripture and memorising that because that's a really powerful tool that we can use as followers of Jesus uh, to be yeah, having that in our daily lives. One of the biggest things we'll be putting in these newsletters is a short video um, every week as a bit of an extra devotion um, with each of our leaders talking about the topic of fear and anxiety and that's a really relevant topic for a lot of us in this time and um, I think a lot of us are struggling on different levels with fear and anxiety and what that looks like today. So we'll be doing a couple extra videos here and there where we as leaders will be sharing our experience with fear and anxiety and what that's looked like in our lives and how we've um, sought God in those moments where things have been uncertain. These newsletters will also provide a way for you to hear from us about any other relevant news or information that's coming out during the term. Um, so it will be a really good resource for you to have so that you're kept up to date on what's happening in the life of Neon Jaffa. If you haven't already submitted a registration form at the start of the year when you first came to Neon Jaffa, can I please be encouraging you to check out the links that are accompanying this video um, and through that you can fill out a Google form so that we can get your contact details. This will be a really important thing for us to have during this time so that you can stay connected with us so that we can continue to send you emails and you can have access to this content that we'll be bringing out. Parents, can I also encourage you to not only give us your details, but your children's details as well. Um, sometimes life can get crazy and if we send things to you, that may not 
necessarily get passed on to your kids. So if you are comfortable, please send us those details as well so that we can get in contact with your children and they can um, be seeing the content that we're bringing out um, as the term goes on. That would be really great. All of these emails that I've spoken about just now, the newsletters and everything like that, these will all be available through our Facebook account as well and the links will be available on our Instagram as well. Um, so this will all just be so that you guys have every possible way to stay connected, but it is important that we have your email address as well, um, just so that we can be covering all bases um, and get that information to you in the easiest way possible. I hope this has all made sense and that it hasn't brought up any questions for you. If it has though, please feel free to email us at this email address down below. Um, we'll be monitoring that and get back to you if you have any questions or concerns about anything that we've spoken about. Otherwise, we really look forward to seeing you this term at Neon Jaffa. It's going to look different. It's going to be messy at times, but we really hope that you'll stick around. We're all in this together, so it's really important that we stay tight as a group and continue to be um, in relationship with one another as we go through this. Um, so I hope to see you all soon. Um, goodbye from me.